Good morning, guys. We have a sundial. One of those odd things I found on Thingiverse. I was actually looking for a solar clock. And yes, logically, a sundial is a solar clock. So I printed it off. And we'll see if it works. Hi guys, just printed off this sundial. Uh, it does have another name, but yeah, sundial. I was looking for solar clocks on Thingiverse, and this came up, which is logical. It's sun powered. Um, that bit goes in there. Yeah, there, one way or the other, but you align it with north, which is why I've got my compass there, because you'll notice there's no sun at the moment. That, of course, disappeared as soon as I tried to set this up. There was a bit of sun just now, so we'll see if it... Yeah, at the moment, that is showing between 11 and 12. And in fact, the time is just coming up to 1 o'clock. Let's just go a bit closer. See if we can actually see the shadow on it. Not at the moment, we'll have to wait. But yeah, the shadow's coming over here. I think I, oh, I don't know, I could turn that a little bit. Oh, I knocked it. But the point is, that's showing, yeah, nearer. 11 o'clock, I would say, at the moment. And the time is nearer 1 o'clock. Mm, got a bit of sunshine. Now, the only thing is, we're on British summer time. So that could be right. What do you think? Spring forward, yes, we put the clock forwards an hour, haven't we? So that's showing, or at least when the shadow was there, it was showing somewhere between 11 and 12. And it's actually between 12 and 1. Hmm, I have to think about that. If we're lucky, we might get a bit more sunshine. Oh, there we are, there's a bit of sunshine. Yeah, that's showing... About half past eleven, according to that. And we're, as I say, nearer one o'clock. Now again, to be fair, it doesn't actually say a line with the North Pole. It says a line with the North Star. So maybe I'm out a little bit. And what I could do is I could actually do a time adjustment. In other words, reset the clock. So now that's now pointing at one o'clock. And if we get any sunshine this afternoon, we can have a look to see how far around it goes. Yeah, sun's not playing ball with me, is it? it keeps disappearing. We'll have a look later. We're off for a cup of coffee now, anyway. Well, I've just set the time-lapse camera up to track the sun on the sundial. But as you can probably hear, 
It's raining hard. Oh dear. We're not going to have much success with this today. Still, I'll leave it running and we'll see how, whether we get anything. Right, we're actually getting a bit of sunlight. It has been raining most of the afternoon. Uh, it's now 10 to 5. So, yeah. Well, if we're looking at the shadow there, that's saying about half past 5 there, I would say. It depends on, I guess, you're supposed to be looking at the actual point. But the sun's so low in the sky, because it's still, what are we, March, April, just beginning of April. So it, it's, it's too low to give you the point on the actual dial. So... Uh, I don't think we're going to be telling the time very well from this. I'll keep it. We'll have a look later in the, maybe in the summer, see if it's more accurate. But this time of year, especially with it raining, <laughs> we're not going to know. As you can tell, the sun's gone in now, so we can't tell anything. Yeah, that'll do for the video anyway. Thanks for watching. If you want more information, check down below in the video description. If you like this video, you might like this one up here. And if you want to subscribe, you can check out my channel over here. Up here is my latest video on my channel. And down here is a video playlist associated with the video you've just watched. Thanks again for watching.